A popular high school football coach accused of inappropriately touching one of his students. Hello, everybody, and thanks for joining us. I'm Tracy Carlos. The girl's mom is speaking to News Channel 5, hoping it doesn't happen again to someone else. The teacher in question is the head football coach at Northwest High School in Canal Fulton. Derek Waller is digging into the girl's claims, and Derek, this is not the first allegation against the man. Well, Tracy, Vic Whiting was accused of touching a 15-year-old student and settled a lawsuit more than two decades ago, but he's never been criminally charged or admitted to any wrongdoing. Tonight, I confronted him about the latest allegation. Mr. Whiting? Vic Whiting shut the door when he saw our camera. The 60-year-old head football coach at Northwest High School declined to answer our questions about allegations he inappropriately touched one of his 15-year-old female students three weeks ago. She said he massaged her shoulders and he stroked her arm and neck. In class? In class. In front of other students? In front of other students. The teen's mom didn't want her face on camera, but tells me she immediately pulled her daughter out of that money management class and went to the principal. He said that they just investigated it in-house, mm -hmm. and that's where they were going to leave it. Shouldn't that be a criminal matter? It absolutely should be. So she took it to Canal Fulton Police on May 6. Since then, she says several other girls have come forward, and these are just the latest claims. Whiting's been accused of inappropriately touching a female student before. The first time was 26 years ago in 1990 at a Catholic school outside Toledo. Whiting dismissed those allegations in this 10-year-old Akron Beacon Journal article saying, quote, it's dead and gone, so no comment. The article also quotes a superintendent at the time who said he was aware of the allegations but believed there was nothing to them. If there's a past, I would want to know exactly what the deal is. This parent is keeping an open mind. When people get accused of things that they haven't done, you know, you're innocent until proven guilty. But now a storm cloud is brewing over Northwest, and the accuser's mom is preparing her daughter for what's to come. I keep trying to encourage her and tell her that I'm proud of her because she gave these girls a voice that didn't have one before. And no comment so far from the athletic director or the school superintendent. I left the messages, but a school board meeting set for Monday night at the high school is expected to be standing room only. I'm Derek Waller, News Channel 5.